Hello, it's Ralph's yeah. mash night. Gotta finish the mash, right? We got all of our fresh sprouts already sprouted that Kramer is enjoying, right? We got Thrive Exotic Blend in here, the Citizen Sprouting Blend, the Microgreen mm -hmm. Sprouting Blend, some all-in-one seed mix, and some extra Gabonzo beans, Black Gabonzo beans, and yeah. whole mm -hmm. beans. Anyway, I like to take you on the journey each week on how I prepare this weekly roast and mash because um, this is how a uh, very convenient, easy, affordable way of offering our birds a diversity of all whole foods. So essentially, you make this once a week, you store it in your fridge, and you have fresh foods to offer your birds every day. Now, I often get asked, how do you keep it fresh for a whole week? Well, there's a couple of uh, concepts or tips or tricks that I can share with you with that. Number one, because we're combining a whole bunch of ingredients, it tends to do better and stay fresh longer. But the, the dry ingredients that I add early on in the process is definitely a huge, huge solution in keeping your mash fresh. For example, I add in the Puri Blossom. This is a formulation that Deanna Garrett and I worked on together that is a combination of some edible flowers, spices, even some millet, uh, star anise. There, there's such a diversity in this bag. Um, so it adds diversity of raw whole foods, but also it helps to absorb the extra moisture that is going to exist on your produce and your sprouts. So it does help to um, you know, absorb a bunch of moisture. So I'll start with the prairie blossom. I add about a cup of that into the mash. So for me, it's like a half, a half of this bag. I don't measure anything exact in the first cream of water. Wants to bust my horn, okay? So about half of the bag of the curry blossom. Next is unsweetened shredded coconut. Um, all of this, by the way, you can get on my website at paratsarus.net. You could also uh, buy direct from any of these great small businesses like China Prairie, True Leaf Market, Argiri Snacks, to name a few. Tops Parrot Food. Yeah. Anyway, the unsweetened shredded coconut, I use about, I'd say about a cup. Next is the hemp hearts. Complete protein. Yeah. Can't say enough great things about hemp hearts. Great for our birds, it's great for us. I like to yeah. add this to my yogurt. I add about a cup of this as well. Okay, so that's the dry ingredients. Yeah. That is a huge tip. Yeah. And keeping the raw food mash fresh for the whole week. <laughs>